hey, the weekend is coming. The weekend is coming. Good Lord Almighty, the weekend is coming. Welcome back to Bruce with Beck. I'm your host, Dan. How the hell are you and your upcoming weekend? Hope you'll, Hopefully you're phenomenal. I am uh, I am phenomenal. Thank you. Thank you for not asking. Um, anyway, the beer in front of me that's starting out the weekend bid is from Mother Earth Brewing out of Vista, California. This one is Project X Fractured Reality. It is 7.5 on the Richter. You betcha. Uh, it is, so basically it's a nice single, uh, full single New England style IPA. Uh, it features Eldorado, Citra, and Triumph, uh, with a gold, it's supposed to be a golden, glowing golden hue. Soft, weedy mouthfeel is complemented by distinct hop characteristics with notes of sweet stone fruit and a touch of dank pine. Now, I had to remind myself, Eldorado, I think you're supposed to get pineapple, pear, watermelon, stone fruit, you know, those types of things. And then Triumph, which I rarely see, those hops, um, uh, intense and fruity aromas with prominent peach, lime, and orange, followed with suggestions of spice and pine, uh... So, there you go. And Citra, you know, I always get citrus, grape, you know, feel like grapefruit. Tropical, some other stuff, some other cool stuff I don't even know about. Anyway, this is just over a month in the can, so still relatively fresh. F -f fresh. What's up, Ollie G? Uh, that's about it. Uh, can't wait to dive into it. Uh, it's going to be a glorious weekend. What up, Timmy Tebow? What up, Buffaloes? Yeah, I I'm sure you probably saw Maverick, but... You know who the top that is, and uh, it's not the Masters this weekend, but uh, faint, what is it? FedEx uh, St. Jude Championship, first part of the, the uh, playoffs in the FedEx Cup. Check that out. Tony Finau, you got to win this one. Anyway, uh, that's neither here nor there. Let's pour this beer, shall we? Out of Vista, California, Project X, fa Fractured Reality. All right. I ask you a very simple and usual favor. Will you please tap finesse and crush that like button much appreciated and if you could uh if you haven't already subscribed please subscribe that way you can sit down with a cold drink with me anytime you want all right all right all right please like and subscribe thank you so much love you uh just another side note uh my buddy pete says i don't uh, brag enough i'm just not i'm more of a humble i'm so hum i'm so humble but what is this oh yeah yeah the big league won the championship this year. Boom. Hard Rock Center Bar League. Suck on that, y'all. Won the, the big money and the big respect. Bronco Bob here. Boom. Get back on that trophy. Sitting champion. So there you go, Pete. There you go, Pete. Down your throat. Uh, just like this about to go. All right. Let's get a aroma on this one. Okay. Br getting, uh, getting either a bready malt or a bready dry hop. Maybe a little tangerine, like subtle tangerine and, uh, you know, bready malt. Okay. All right. I'm going to dive in. No words. Just Tim Tebow today and my trophy. All right. All right. Let's, let's go. Definitely get, I, I, first thing comes to mind is, is a little bit of uh, peach and pear together. Um. Nice creaminess, nice smoothness. Definitely, you know, yeah, like kind of a bready malt. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. What am I supposed to get from Triumph? Already getting the peach. I'm supposed to get that from Triumph. Maybe that's what I'm getting. I'm supposed to have orange. I don't really know if I get spice and pine, but definitely get citrus, so you're going to say I got lime. Uh, yeah, I do get pineapple pear. Not sure about watermelon, uh, but it, overall stone fruit. Um, but getting that from the Eldorado. And yeah, the, ba the basics, I do get a, like peach, pineapple pear, a little, little, little bready malt. Maybe, oats, maybe some oats, obviously. Okay, but it is nice and smooth. Uh, I would, you know, I don't know if I would have guessed if this was a blind tasting, if I would have said seven, five, I may have just said seven, but nice and smooth. It's 
I feel like, I mean, no wrong. It, it, yeah, you can't really see, but I've seen thicker than this. Um, I feel like that if this does have any oats in it, it's not much. So just enough to give it, an, you know, the look of a, a badass New England IPA. Um, anyway, um, I may not even need to go to break on this. I think I may have, have an idea of what I, what I think. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Yeah, there's just a little sediment. Yep, I'm going to have to go to break just, just for a sec. Hold that thought. I'm going to relish this for another minute, and then we're going to uh, give final thoughts on a grade. You stay put, Timmy. All right, all right, all right. Boom. Um, so, yeah, nothing, uh, nothing more that I haven't discovered. Um, peach, pineapple, um, it, it does say a weedy mouthfeel. So there you go. It's more we weedy. I was thinking maybe it was like, a, you know, a, uh, bready malt or whatever. I think it's just from wheat. Uh, I'd say 30, 30, 30% on the mouthfeel. So, um, uh, not quite for, for me, not quite medium, but for a lot of people it'd be about medium mouthfeel. Uh, 30 out of 100. Um, and, uh, yeah, just nice, easy going. Um, that's about it. Now let's, let's get to the grade on this, shall we? Because, you know, I got more stuff to do. So do you. All right. From a stellar down to, oh, hell no. We are going, giving Mother Earth Brewing a... Starting the weekend, decent... Pretty, pretty, pretty decent. Um, yeah, 92 out of 100, A minus, nice beer. Um, I think these were literally like, what were they, 350 a, a pint, something like that. Not bad, for especially for 92. Pretty happy with that. So, excuse me, carbonation. Um, all right. Well, down the hatch. Uh, I did, I will say that on the, on the smell, you do get, I feel like I get like a little mixture of like nice tropical fruit meats, make, make maybe like, I don't know if it's lupulin powder and melon, but it's a, it does have a nice smell to it. So, uh, that's about it. Remember, help me out, help me out, like, and subscribe, especially for, for this guy and this guy and golf. All right. Let's down the hatch. Cheers. Finito, finito. All right, that's about it. Hopefully you are enjoying your day. Like and subscribe, like and subscribe. We'll see you out there. Good talk.